Hello guys, hello guys, hello guys. Okay, a lot of smiley, a lot of freaking grinning. Why? Because when was the last time you pulled up on this channel and you saw me sitting down on my sofa talking to you? Like, like it's just we haven't done this in a very long time. So first and foremost, happy new year. Let's start off there, happy new year. Guys, I need to breathe. <laughs> God, that took, that, that, that. I felt like I was like speed talking. Anyway, so your girl went to Lagos. Um, I went to Lagos for my girl's wedding, Monica's wedding, and we had a time. Like it was incredible. So I'm taking you with me. I'm taking you with me. I'm not literally going today, but I've obviously already gone. I'm, I've come back now and this is about, you're about to watch the vlog. The reason I'm talking and giving you this little intro is because there is no intro. Literally, as soon as I got to Lagos, it was like abuse and attack. Immediately, I had to get out of my house. Um, so yeah, and then also just to let you know that, you know, maybe, maybe the vlogs are back on this channel because they are, um, you know, we tried a thing or two for a while and changes happen and this is definitely a year of change, a year of, girl, like listen, we're back, okay, we're back, so um, yeah, that is pretty much what I wanted to tell you. I hope you enjoy this vlog. I don't want to make the intro too long, but you will see this version of me, as in this woman today, you will see her come up in, like, in some parts of this video, because I want to give you some context. Um, because some of the clips, they're a bit like, eh, what's going on here? So I might just, like, come back and just explain real quick. So yeah, I hope you enjoy this vlog. It's such a vibe, so enjoy it. Bye. I just arrived in Nigeria, and it's moving chaotic already. Hello. Um... So Monica has forced to come and get me. She's literally coming to grab me from my place. Well, my brother's place, my brother and sister's place. Okay, cool. So she's gonna come and get me. We're gonna quickly go to her shop to go and get my dress tailored for the wedding. Um, I wish I even had a minute just to even like show you guys around because this place is crazy. As soon as I came in, I literally was like, so my brother was like, I know I'm gonna have the best time here. Like, anyway, so I packed my hair back real quick, put on a quick little outfit and then yeah, I'm gonna go grab food on the way as well. Anyway, we in Nigeria. We are in Nigeria. And we are here for the, oh, uncle's like, what the hell is going on right now? Monica has like attacked me out of the house, so. She has to, she's the only person that's come at a reasonable time. Yeah, I'm actually, everyone else, that? everyone else comes, well, I was on our way to the shop as well, so you two Oh, we're gonna be there together, oh, yeah. yay. You two are the only reasonable Perfect. people. Screaming. Oh, you know them, ask them. <laughs> Us are the only reasonable um, people, well not us two. Me and Adeline. Yeah, are the only reasonable people. Yeah. So, so they're going to be the only people that get adjusted today. Everyone else is going to be rushing, rushing in tomorrow. tomorrow. No, thank for you. For alterations. Hopefully they can also still help me do these two dresses that I want to do though. That's, that's why they should come now before their yeah. break. It's not anything crazy, it's just the start. an hour and then... I still can't oh believe God, you have, can like, you give me a favor? Like, what do you need? Um, just for mine. Let me put this down. I'll be back, guys. Monica's left, and now we're making our way. I can't believe I'm in Nice. I just need a minute to, like, even digest all the stuff that's going on right now, because what? Me coming out of the airport this morning was, like, crazy. I was like, yeah, I'm defo. Anyway. Anyway, cool. So I'm going to go to Monica's shop now to go get my wedding dress fitted. Um, well, so me and Adam, I think we're just basically explaining that. And I'm in a car with Monica's driver, which is really cute. And then I'm gonna go to my, I'm gonna go to Miss K. I'm gonna go get some food from my bro, my sister's shop. Oh, this is a bumpy ride. And yeah, Lagos living for real. Listen, I'm walking around with no data. I haven't got a SIM card. I haven't got my bank card sorted yet. I am on vibes. I got my food. Yay! I got apple crumble pasta and I got salmon. I already have the the pasta's cooked. I'm trusting. I'm trusting that my my people's they got me. They can cook like that. Um, I actually really need to find somewhere that I'm gonna do my hair tomorrow. I'm seeing loads of like beauty stores and stuff like that, so I feel like I'll be I'll be fine. I'll be covered. I'm even just thinking like I don't know how smart I was in my packing because I'm thinking, do I even have the right makeup? Because I didn't really get any makeup that's like good for heat. Like, I didn't really bring any sort of setting spray that's gonna. Anyway, anyway. Oh, we were. It's as well. It's not there deep. Everywhere you walk into, and now it's just literally air central, so we'll be fine. But I'm really excited to be here. Hello, can anybody hear me? Cool. I'll see you when I get to Monica Show. <laughs>
good hairstylist. What in Lagos? Yeah. Like for what? I just want to do camos or bags. What like like Ghana or just? No, just I'll let me show you a picture. Maybe like ten. Well, I feel like most places, but my intentions is good. Oh, yeah. I have someone that can come to the house. Back indoors, I feel peaceful again. What? That was crazy. I, don't, I didn't even end up. Look at my hair. That's how you know everything was crazy. Like, look at my hair. I'm going to go get my hair done tomorrow. I want to get my hair washed. I want to have an experience. Morning. Morning, morning, morning. Oh. oh wow. Christ of Nazareth. <laughs> no stress. This is so funny. I literally put on my camera and you lot said, my friend messaged this morning. My friend literally messaged this morning. She was like, we brought the night of London weather to Lagos <laughs> with us. And it's so true. Hello. I'm about to do my hair. I just had the nicest wash. Like, I don't know what she put. I need to find oh, it. Huh? No, literally. Up never, for real. Um, I don't know what she put on my hair, but it just feels so good and healthy like it's amazing anyway i'll be back when the lights are back on properly bye <laughs> Lovely, lovely, lovely people. I'm home. I'm home. I'm tired. My heart is racing. I'm not gonna lie to you. My heart is racing because Nigeria is so fast paced. Everything just be going fast, fast. Mickey and Deal. Mickey and Deal. But we gotta carry on, do what we gotta do. Okay. See, perfect. That's why I didn't do my Jamaican accent that day. Anyway, hot, beating fast. Um, all right, just got back home. My hair is done. I don't know if this lighting is the best, but I've managed. I literally, I need to start getting ready, but I want to just unpack because I can't kind of kill myself. So let's just unpack. And then, um, yeah, we're just going to unpack. I've decided that I'm not going to unpack because I feel like that's just really bad use of my time. So what I'm going to do is just unpack some of my items, um, like stuff that I need today, basically, and then just close everything else and put the boxes to the side. Later, at some point, we'll do, we'll do a room tour, all of that, or um, place tour. Because this house is so beautiful, it's so beautiful and so comfortable and I'm just so proud of my people then for just creating such a beautiful space for themselves. Um, so yeah, let's just unpack some of the bits inside here. After cleaning my room or kind of unpacking a little bit, I had to get ready really quickly for Monica's mixer. Well, not really quickly, but I had to get ready for Monica's mixer, which is the first night. It's the first, am I, I low key, low key after the wedding, this is my favorite night. This is the night where all, everybody, all her guests, well, like us young babes, you know, the peoples met up, um, wearing all white, the boys, the girls. It just was such a vibe. I've left the house. I look cute as hell. Um, like I said, today is a mix and I, and yeah, we're just gonna go and have a good time, meet the other rest of the people and go. He's thinking, what is this woman doing? All right, thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, bye. Um, I'm gonna go meet Crystal. Crystal's one of my friends who's here, or Monica's friend also. Um, and we're gonna go in together because we are both kind of late, but not late. Not late, but could have been earlier. Thank you. Did I forget anything? We need to take off my makeup first and foremost. Tonight was amazing. And that's all that mattered. Ah! Stop it. Okay, wow. That feels like a relief. 
my friend called me crystal and she i called her actually and ended up finding out she's like stuck outside of her house because she went to the club after monica's event um so she's got no way of getting inside her house because her cousin had like locked the door or something and her cousin like knocked out she's just arriving now so i told her to come here so she she just got here now that's so funny did you she's been getting bright outside morning it's literally morning time hello friend thank you hi Hello. Good night. Good night. Hello. Do you want to take your makeup off? Okay, let me take you upstairs. Hello. Hey. We're at my friend's house. Please, 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 please. Of course, of course, I know that. Now we're moving on to day three. This was the tropical no sorry the bridal shower we're going to the bridal shower and honestly the amount of times yeah i went to the salon in lagos should actually be studied like it's actually low-key inappropriate like what the heck was going on with me and i wouldn't change it for a day i would i would do it the exact same way again good morning this is quite you ready yeah amazing we are going to go get my hair done yes i got my hair done yesterday and yes i'm getting it done again tomorrow today because it's a different look today and we want a different hairstyle for the look um so yeah it's hot it's real hot outside today i don't know why i'm wearing a black top because i'm actually gonna go get black hair i don't know if it's gonna look anyway it's just to go do my hair this outfit is crazy what the hell am i wearing right now hi opinion how are you thanks for dropping me yesterday okay cool we are about to go the location is like 20 minutes from here can we also quickly just oh, sorry on the way can i get yam and egg Have for a few days because I don't know why I'm putting myself through so much while I like girl. By the way, did I even tell you my thought process why I'm not even getting wigs? Because originally I was supposed to put heat on my hair and just get like um cameras for like the last like next three days. But the girls were just like, it doesn't make sense. I'm just gonna put heat on my hair. If I do cameras, I'll be taking out the hair after putting it through tension taking out after two days which is just not wise and then so I was like the only option is to wear wigs and I don't you guys know I haven't really worn wigs in a while but obviously here we are wigging it up wigging it up um yeah yeah that's been us that's been me what was I gonna say yeah we're just gonna quickly get food from this place I like this hair though it reminds me of like old me I feel like this is giving very like old ones <laughs> Ready to go. Very late. Oh, thank you so much. I'm just about to do a quick get ready with me. I don't even have time, but we're gonna try to do it. I love this hair. Do you have finished with this? No, not on me. Do I need it? What next to it? So I can just go there after. Oh, in amazing, and they have bikinis there. Amazing! Oh my god, look at my life. That was amazing. I'm gonna leave the house now. Um, and yeah, should we do a quick? Did I show you my full fit? I feel like you guys deserve your own full fit moment. Hey, I'm gonna have to put you over there for a full fit. Please, oh, I'm ready to go. Sorry, don't mind me. Okay, cool. Yeah, this is the full fit. Oh my gosh, I think the camera's angled. I'm gonna give it to you guys, but. Um, I'm off um, and I will take you with me throughout the day. I just want to move. Uh huh, that's better. I don't like it when the fringe is like fringy. I want it to be like missing parts. Anyway, bye.
It's a really beautiful song. You'll all love it. Can we? Okay, thank you. Rachel is a lizard. Here we go. There we go. Come on now. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. And my head, I'm saying, Take you say, I, I was saying, do you want me to sing the song? Yeah, please. All right. Um, <laughs> I need the beat. It's quite hard. Yeah. Singing. I thought we were mates. I thought we were friends. Yeah! Hey! Hey! Get it! Get it! Hey! Hey! Night before the wedding, I finished doing my hair. We've kind of had it wrapped up. And now I came with Rachel to come to Rachel's hotel because they're switching hotels. So they're switching hotels. So we came to her hotel really quickly to come and get their stuff. Because we like this place. Oh, because the hotel's really nice. And we yeah. did get to network. Network? No. <laughs> I hear it. Because it will make sense. This place is really nice. No, the, the hotel be, is the hotel is stunning. It's called the Arts London. Love this hotel. It's so beautiful. Do you want to put these? Can you put these show them inside? Let me yeah, show you. Just in case you're someone who wants to come to Lydia, this hotel is so nice. I'm obviously staying with family, but bruh. I'm going to do a quick tour of your hotel because it's so flipping hot. It's so cute. <laughs> Oh, thank you. And it's also nice aircon. The aircon is so amazing. Anyway, and it smells beautiful, and the art everywhere is just so pretty. I don't know what their room looks like. Um, or looked like, so I don't want to say anymore. Now, but yeah, it's so pretty. So yeah, it's called the Art, the Art Hotel Lagos. She's here already. I'm back for my makeup done in Nigeria. If you know me, you know I don't do what get no one to do my makeup because I'm scared as hell. Good morning, guys. Oh, I mean, I think I've already said good morning, but we're downstairs now. Not doing it. Well, not about to start. As you can see, my makeup is done, nearly done. But um, I feel so pretty. Hello. She did my makeup. Yay. She's done such a good job. I'm really happy I trusted her. Because when she came in, I was like, I'm scared of makeup. It's basically me. But she's done such a good job. Mon is getting her makeup done as well. And the rest of the bridesmaids are in their rooms doing theirs. She looks so delicious. Let me zoom in so you guys can see it. How do I zoom? Here we go. Oh my god, guys. Look at my face. She looks. <gasps> Monica, this video looks amazing. I'm recording you. It looks so good. Doesn't that look so cute? Oh my god. So good. I'll send it to you. But yeah, we're just doing, um, everybody just doing their makeup. Monica's maid of honor, she's upstairs. And all the other bridesmaids are gonna come downstairs and we're gonna do a shoot back there. Back there. This looks like a movie. I'm sorry, what? Hello. <laughs> You're fine, babe. Okay, I am done. You guys know me, I'm so extra because I definitely came upstairs and decided to add an extra touch to my makeup. And low key, I think it was very unnecessary, but I am who I am. Hi! Hey, baby. Hi! Oh, you look so, so beautiful. Ah! Coley, you're getting there. I love you. I love you. Oh, oh don't make me cry. Stop. Okay, goodbye. Oh, Why would you cry? Ew. 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 Because we have our makeup on. Let me go downstairs. Do you need help getting ready or are you good? Oh, you oh. Babes, she did really good.
is the day after Monica's wedding. I am finished. I am currently outside her house actually because yesterday she ended up taking my suitcase home because I went to go stay, sleep elsewhere. Um, I went to go stay at Ruth's house, Ruth and Mary, gosh, Maria, um, my friends. So yeah, now I'm outside Monica's house. I've never actually been here. I can't believe it's my first time in this place. Look at this little lizard, guys. It's so cute. I hope it doesn't run away. I hope you can see it. Can you see it? Hello! Lizard! Okay. No, it's gone, guys. Never mind. But, guys, I keep having amazing conversations with Uber drivers, man. I keep having really, really nice conversations with Uber drivers. Like, it's so nice and refreshing. Like, I don't know, I get in the car. I might start recording it, but I get in the car. And we just talk about God, we talk about life, we talk about our needs, our desires, our wants. Their wants, well mainly theirs. Their wants, what keeps them hopeful, what keeps them grounded. It's always nice. Hello. What are you selling? Good evening. What are you selling? What are you selling? Selling. Yeah, on your head. What's that? What drink is it? Ashley. Are you selling it? Yes. Okay, can I see it and see if I want it? How much are you selling this for? Ashley. 300. Yes. Can I see it? Yes. Aww. Can I get it? Huh? It I have to help you. Okay, yes. give me one second. Let me help you. Uh, let's see. Do you want to say hello to my camera? Hi! <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. Oh, it's not a sweet drink. No, I said nah, I shouldn't be bad. Oh, sorry, I thought it was like a cold drink or mm -hmm. something nice. I'm so sorry. No, no, I don't want this one. Okay. I'm sorry, I wasted your time. Okay. Can I give you something just to... Okay. Because I wasted your time. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah? No, outside the door. Is it open? Oh, I didn't even knock. I just thought so. Anyway, please, I'm still treating this place like London. I'm waiting for someone. To... <laughs> I can't believe this is my first time here. Hey, we got a party. Yeah, it's Hey Home. Is she awake? Okay. Hello. Oh my God. Babe, this place is huge. Is that for me? Oh, thank you. Hello. Oh, you've lost your voice. Shit. Yeah. You look so cute. Look at this Babe, why are you still dressed up? Babe, I've not done anything with my life today. So I've not showered. Okay. Yes, babe. Okay, okay, let me go. Bye bye. I'll be back soon, guys. All right, so now wedding is over. Wedding was absolutely incredible. Obviously, I had my mare because I just, I didn't go to. Ugh. God, I can't believe it. But the day, the morning after the wedding, I just was in another world. I didn't have any of my clothes. Monica had my suitcase. You guys saw that I went to her house to go pick up my suitcase. Um, but yeah, so I think maybe it was like a day or two later, we went to, we were gonna go to a beach house, which I was really excited for because I had this image, yeah. As soon as I got my fringe, the day that I got my fringe done, I said to myself, for the beach day, I'm gonna wear my purple two-piece and I'm gonna have my hair in a fringe and it's gonna be a look. So again, I went to the salon to get my hair done. Like, how many times am I gonna go to the salon to get my hair done? Also, I'm actually editing as I'm like talking. Um, well, not editing as I'm talking, but like I'm editing and then talking to you guys. Anyway, so that's what you're about to watch. Me going to get my hair done and then we're gonna get lit in the beach house. Guys, if the look I'm doing today is not even worth all this madness I put myself through today, judge me. Queen, thank you so much. Ah, oh, Queenies. Cornice. 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 Let's get out of here, sir. I didn't close the door. It's too soft. I didn't even, I didn't know that I was grilling. My bad, oh my days. I'm so sorry. No, no, it's okay. 
I thought I was warming something, but I was grilling. Kai. <laughs> and it's gas like, am I okay? My Go with no glass in here. Go with no glass in here. Took so long to come. Uh, one more scrape here, one more clean here. I just wanna be on the beach. Okay, you better go to your con one they come from the good day, but uh at least my outfit looks really nice. And the vision I had did it did vision eyes. So that's good news. Um, I just need to finish off my makeup a little bit, blend things out a little bit better because as you can see, this is really harsh and I hate that for me. Um, but yeah. a little bit so I'm starting every day very slowly I'm going to um, see my friend from London Liz we're going out for breakfast we're gonna go have what are we going to have we're going to go to a place called, called Brisk I'm letting her take full control because she's moved to Nigeria recently so she knows the area place better than me I just be getting in cars and I just be meeting them that's all I have to offer nothing more nothing less anyway this morning about like the severity of prayer bro god been whipping my ass i haven't even told you guys some of the encounters i've been having like my ass is getting whooped like seriously whooped in a good way like god will see you just um, drawing away from him and he gonna bring you right back because after like the witch episode and all these episodes sorry the ex-witch let me stop saying that man um sarah's episode and you know the video with uche and just I guess the kind of conversations that the things I've been talking about online um, I retracted I retracted deeply like proper retracted from God like I stopped reading my journal my, my Bible I stopped writing I stopped praying properly I stopped praying let me not even say properly I just stopped praying um, and it wasn't like I was like mad at God or like whatever but I just felt like I don't know where are you going? is it here? No, yeah, so just if just going straight down okay. when it gets Fine. to the end of that um, But yeah, and then and then a few days. So that went on for like not gonna lie, like two weeks, three weeks, three weeks for sure. About three weeks um, where I just was running <laughs> away because um, I just was like, I don't know if I can handle this. Like, I don't know. I don't. I didn't like. I'm just following. I'm just trying to be obedient. Like, I don't know if I can handle this. And then. The other day, my I can't believe I'm telling you guys this, but I want to because I just think it's so incredible. My pastor came, my sorry, my I got a message. I'm in Nigeria, I'm in Lagos, and obviously, I can feel the effects of like me being out of like my, my walk is you know having on me, the toll it's out taken on me. And I get a message from my pastor and my pastor's assistant because nobody has my pastor's number. And she was like, Hey, woman, a pastor wants to speak to you, would love to have a meeting with you. And I was thinking, Pastor Mike wants to have a meeting with me, what the heck? Like. I'm scared but a part of me also kind of felt like I was like this is God this is God I kind of I had a feeling so I called um, Leah and I'm like Leah like fuck what's my boss speak to me she's like hmm like you know anyway we jump on the zoom call the day that I was even getting my hair done bro he was just, boom bam he just sort of straight up asked me where are you at with God where are you at with God where is your religion? Where is your spiritual life? Or something like that. And I was like, I've been running. I've been running away. I've not been reading anything. Or like, you know, I just was honest. And he was, and he kind of asked me why. And I just kind of told him what was going on. And, you know, how like some of the episodes and things I've been like talking about have been affecting me. I didn't even realize and blah, blah. And he just was like, you've been in my spirit for the last no no he kn opinion knows you know how to do it right he knows thank you we're just about a minute away um uh, i even lost my train of thought sorry i was just saying that yeah he was just like i've been in his spirit for the last three weeks and he needed me 
basically got to call him like bro this baby's running like focus um and it just was incredible I'm, I, I feel like I'm downplaying like what he said quite a lot cause just because I'm in like I'm in a car I'm not really talking properly but I can't lie like I was like God didn't say I'm gonna use one small somebody in your life I'm gonna he said I'm gonna go to what you're going like what you wouldn't expect like I don't speak to my pastor like, we don't you know what I mean obviously I did the interview with him but he's a busy man like there's so many people that go to my church even church I've not been going like that anyway it's just I just was like God is serious and I've been trying since that day I mean without a doubt I've been trying to get back in um because I just have to he said a couple more things but I want to keep that to myself but bro this stuff is very real and I'm just so grateful that God didn't allow me to like stray too far away before telling me my 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 ass to come back home um and then yes yeah, so that's why i brought up what i was talking about this morning about the dream i had this morning about why prayer is so important and the biggest revelation i didn't end up writing a dream brisk it's a restaurant is it here okay guys i'm gonna have to go and like finish this off later but i'll be sure you when i get to the restaurant to take you guys into the restaurant with me but that was such a nice conversation i think the air con is starting to affect me because god i was sneezing a lot um but now i'm going to the miss k shop if i did you guys would have heard me mention miss k giving some context to who she is if i didn't i'll, I'll probably just say it again just in case i didn't when i get back upstairs when i get upstairs Basically, basically, I have a sister and a brother who are my brother and sister because I met them when I was 17 years old and I started doing a shoot for them, Miss K. Um, so she's got a, a brand called Miss K based in Nigeria, or they have a Nigerian brand and they've been growing it and I was their first model. Well, that's a lie, I wasn't their first model, but I was definitely like one of their I worked with them for a long time and they literally became family so like when you hear me say I'm still my brother, I'm still my sister, like that's who I'm talking about, like they're family to me, chosen family and we have like an amazing relationship so while I'm in Nige I'm staying with them but also I'm going to be doing some shoots with them, kind of like a throwback, um, I stopped shooting Miss K like when things picked up like for my career um, and I just became like a bit too busy to do them, to do the shoots so yeah so today they asked me to come into the store to come and do a um a shoot so what kind of like a shoot we're talking about some of my favorite pieces from the collection that they have they're literally like i want to call them like the pretty little thing of nigeria like, they have amazing pieces i'm wearing one of them right now so i've just literally got into the store and i've changed i'm going to show you what the store looks like if you know me from like back in the day like you would know this is this is my room so like miss k boutique i was the miss k girl um, this is the store you can see the girls over there that's where we're shooting the content that we're shooting oh this is a nice set guys i need to show you this store sorry my adhd i don't even want to call that for myself maybe i have it maybe i don't but anyway things just don't happen now but yeah this is what the store looks like it's gorgeous i need to show you downstairs because downstairs is the real prize with like my favorite side that's the men's section women's like they literally bought london to lagos for real and this is me in one of their pieces this is what downstairs looks like i don't know if you can see it probably i'll need to give you a proper tour fun fact fun fact my brother so my i have three brothers three older brothers um well four but th my three blood brothers right they one of them worked here like two years ago before he moved to america with my parents um, so yeah, this place is like, this is, this is family. So yeah, let's go and shoot. But no, this is quite fun though. I feel like I'm in my element. Mm -hmm. How did we, wait, let me ask your girls. How did we find it, guys? Easy. You did it one, She's one. She's a professional. I'm a professional girl. You might be doing this. Her. Her girl. All right, cool. We're going to shoot the last bit, so there was only BTS. Alright, 
the next day. Um, we are up, we are out, we are on our way to go. Oh, I took my hair out. Well, it was in a bun. Oh, it was in plaits. So I took it out because I just need to breathe today and I'm getting my hair done tomorrow. But today I'm going to go meet my nephews, uh, my two nephews and my sister-in-law in my mum's house. Obviously, this is going to be my first time going. Um, so I'm really excited. It's quite far out. We've got like, I, I said it was an hour 30, but it's definitely a solid two hours. I need to double check that, but yeah. So we've got a bit of a long drive ahead of us. Opinion is dropping me today. Opinion, do you want to say hi to the camera? Oh, okay, that's sweet. Okay, well, Opinion is dropping me today. So we're going to make our way. We about to go, we about to go Lagos Island. Hey, that's where we're going. We're going Lagos Island. Yeah. Cool. I just got some food as well, actually from the restaurant that I got food from the first time I got here and it was really good so I'm praying it's really good I got something different today, I got rice it's been a drive it's been a drive it's been a serious freaking drive so straight and then we turn left it's been a drive guys, it's been a drive I'm excited, I'm about to meet my little nephews like this is my pe my, my blood this is my brother's children. This is crazy. I wonder what their personality is gonna be like. And then I'm also meeting my sister-in-law as well. We're nearly there, we're nine minutes away. Man, I can't wait. So originally the plan was that we were gonna go to my mum's house, which is where everyone is at. Um, my mum recently built a house in Lagos. Um, I've never been obviously like it's been a minute or oh, she has it been recently she built it but anyway so oh it's this way to the left yeah so I'm turn right onto Anjoran no, Street where the hell are we it it's no it's saying straight just go you turn this left this way and you go straight down this is mad like I'm seeing so many things that's just bringing back memories for me like this isn't an area that I grew up in but I'm definitely like oh my god so that's what I was gonna say we were, we were supposed to go to the two areas that I grew up in sorry the area that I grew up in um, with my nephews and my, my sister-in-law but there's not gonna be enough time it's already four o'clock I don't want to rush like meeting them I don't want to get them moving and just I just want to sit and just be present and just like chat to everybody and you know what I mean just talk it's saying this this way what oh no maybe it's that next uh, here it's this next left over there on the on the sorry this right coming up this right. yeah this right coming up seven minutes oh that bolly looks nice there their body looks. Yes, oh my god, yes, yes. it's good, right? It looks yes, good. Sorry. Hi. Do you? Uh, you don't write. Do you have um? Do you have um? What's the English? Do you have? Do you have peanuts? Do you have peanuts? peanuts? No ground nuts. Oh. I need ground nuts with it. That's no okay. ground nuts at all. Sweet ground nuts, you know. Do I have? Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 We'll take it. We'll take it. Let's take it. Yeah, let's get it. We're gonna get it. Okay, hopefully this body is nice because you saw the last one was crazy. Um, we got body earlier, yeah, and it was insanely bad. It was so bad. Um, the guy gave me. Hello. How much, man? Yeah. One fifty nine. Oh, he's coming to you. Oh, thank you so much. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Sorry, baby. All right. Ah! Yeah. Sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry, baby. Oh my god. I'm sorry, baby. I broke your balloon. Love you. I just got in here. This is really cute. I think I'm gonna stop vlogging because I just need to be here. Huh? Oh my god. Oh. Oh, you can see yourself in the camera. Do you want to say hello? Come, come sit my lap, let me get you. Come sit my lap. Yes. Okay, give me. Keep it in. You tell me. What else do you have? You didn't know what it was to say yesterday. Oh, what? Okay. I was saying, did you know that wouldn't be nice to speak like we Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! I was just like, I said, did you be so bad that you showed me the video? <laughs> Do you not see how she was Which speaking video? like the, the ah. video that I showed? He said they are speaking like the Ibu that my daddy is working with, that his friend. Where are you going? Can I know? <laughs> I want to know the secret. 
Can I know? What, whisper it to me as well. Let me hear. Oh, you want to go drive your car? I want to give you some context, um, but if you watched my vlog like two years ago when I went to Nigeria and I did my foundation thing with my brother and we went to my old house and we went to the school and we just did, it just was an incredible time. That brother, he's the one, he's the, he's the father of, he's a father, he's my niece's dad. Jesus Christ, why was that so difficult? Um, he was, he's my niece's, sorry, my nephew's dad. So that's the, yeah, that's the, the those are the nephews I went to go meet. Um, like I said, it just feels, it's really interesting because watching them and how they operate and like their vibe, just their whole being, I'm like, it makes sense that you're my family, especially, especially the oldest, especially the oldest. I'm like, get this little man on TikTok immediately because... But yeah, it's nice. I feel like this is such a big year for me when it comes to like reconnecting with family and just doing a lot of like family driven things. I feel like my family is starting to set into place in a way that it's never before. So I'm I'm really looking forward to like building, like building like a really solid family relationship. Like not just my nephews, but with all, with many people in my family, like my brothers. And obviously that's been growing throughout the years, but I really feel like 2024 is gonna really solidify it. Um, and also my sister-in-law, like my, my, my brother's wife, like she's so perfectly suited to him. She's so perfectly suited. My brother, I always tell him like, I'm like, you're like an angel. He's so beautiful. Like he's such a beautiful human. Sadiq, if you're watching this, like love you die. Like he's just such a beautiful man and he's with a beautiful woman. Like just their vibe. It's just, anyway, I'm really happy. I spent some time with them and just like really soaked it in. Um, so yeah. And good morning. The way I was feeling yesterday is definitely catching up to me. I'm very high key. Oh, you okay? Okay. Cool. I'm put um, it's very high key catching up to me. We ended up leaving my sister in law's house. Well, my mum's house. Her house, their house. Um, really late. Well, it wasn't really late. We got home really late because traffic was crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy traffic. I took medication yesterday. I don't really know what I took, but I found some stuff in the drawer. So I took that. But maybe I'm allergic to AC because I ended up sleeping in the living room yesterday without the AC. So I find that because the living room is bigger, um, I can handle not having AC on. But in my room, not having AC on feels like like a hot box. I cannot. So, um, but yeah, that is that is it for today. Today is my last day going to a hair salon in Lagos. Literally my last day going to a hair salon in Lagos. I cannot, it's the last time. I'm gonna go get my hair done this morning. I've got dinner with Adiola tonight at like seven. What's oh. up? Good morning. I used to the job at the session. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you see? I don't know him, but I don't have a says. What happened? Yeah, like, Is he new? He, yeah. yeah okay. Oh, did he think he was still in the car? <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. Don't beat me up. I finished all my hair and I ran home. I mean, I say that, but it literally took us approximately six or more hours to finish this hair. Oh my God, this bag is so heavy. It took us ages to finish my hair. And... Girl, like I said, that illness was trying to beat me, but I beat it because I'm actually feeling a lot better now. I'm back home. But I want to get ready in this bathroom today because I want my makeup to look really nice. And I really like this bathroom. And if a bathroom is good, it means more time, more time. Your mom. Okay. okay. More time, it means your makeup will come out good. Oh my god. VI, VI, VI. Lucky, 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 lucky. lucky. Okay, we're on to the second part of the day. I didn't know Adiola was good. Now we are on our way to. I want to sneeze so bad. Okay, cool.
Um, no, Fanta will actually do me Fanta. justice. Actually, no, Coke. Coke is better. Oh, gin and tonic. Which one is that one? Let me see what it looks like. Gin and tonic is an alcohol. No, oh, no. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> I think I'm going to stop drinking alcohol. I don't think it's for me anymore. I hear that. After yesterday. Hello. <laughs> Guys, doing, sorry. Yeah? I came oh, on. I'm not even talking to you, but yesterday, after yesterday, I got home and things just things quite quickly so it's the next day and I didn't want to start the next day without updating you I feel like Lagos is just so fast I myself oh, can't shit. even keep up I'm not no you're not don't worry I myself cannot even keep up but um today I'm at a fitting which is really cool I've never done anything like this not in Lagos um for a brand called Mizell hello how are you how are you I'm good thank you what's your name sir? oh nice to meet you nice to meet you ignore me I'm just recording no it's fine you're fine you're fine um, no, 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 this is good for me. This is good for now. It's even frozen. Can I get the Coke instead then, please? Do you want oh, they're all now? frozen. Yeah, I think they're... I don't know why this is... Just, uh, I, like I need to show you this place, it's so amazing. It's so oh, no, the yeah, the Coke is perfect, yeah. thank you. Oh, you want wine? Huh? Wine? Oh, no, not yet. Not yet. Not yet. It's still early in the day. What did Mercedes end up getting? Good. For the fitting? I was because I was in it. I left it. Okay, but yeah, so guys, the stuff are amazing and so me. Today I feel like a grown baby, I didn't shave my feet. I'm so sorry this vlog has been like up, down, left, right, middle, center point and I've not been as thorough as I probably want to be. Um, but Lagos is so fast, man. Lagos is so fast, but I'm really enjoying it. I've got like three more days before I leave. I didn't even like debrief on how me, my nephew was because my nephews and sister-in-law who is like perfect fit for my brother but i feel like i need to just get back home not london but like even my um my brother's house and just debrief on things because i think things are moving like 100 miles per hour i don't know how i'm gonna edit this vlog but god bless us all um but yeah i'm just really happy like today's a really nice day um and i'm also really excited that you go back to london low-key i want to see my man i can't lie anyway so yeah we're in the studio today trying on some stuff let's look at this look at this look at this space oh my god oh yeah there's like two events um we're going to today so there's this i'm going to and then i've got irene um from the uk she's doing an event today so we're gonna go to that and then what else am i doing and then oh my god adi clear gold show no before that i've got miss k event that i'm hosting today um i think i've told you guys enough about miss k so today is the event they're doing and then in the evening i've got an adi clear gold show at like 10 o'clock guys guys you're thinking what the heck happened how did you get back here bro i need the aircon on because i even need a moment to breathe i was stuck stuck i was stuck in standstill traffic for four hours yesterday four hours <laughs> honestly i came i like i could not believe it so i did all the fitting and everything got the outfit obviously went to irene's event it was amazing it was great got in the car to go to miss k's event got there it was good it was great bro <laughs> left now it's now eight o'clock to go to the event bear in mind yeah the event was 16 minutes away from miss k's shop cool i'm in a boat we're driving we are in traffic for, and you know what's so funny as well like i've called my friend i've called ruth and maria and i'm like guys leave your house now like i'm on my way even telling them like don't be late you know i love adequate gold like i really want to like listen why is it why is it freeze why is why is the aircon so cold or hot i was like oh guys like leave your house you know don't be late i really want to see adequate set i got to the show at 12 30. my friends got there at 10 they left the house later than me i was so upset I was so upset because the car was hot. It was, like, I've never experienced standstill like that in my life. In my life. I just said, we got to the venue and my driver, bless him, like I felt so bad for him as well because I was thinking, imagine you you go out of your house, like going to work and you're just stuck in traffic and you're not making money. And it, it just was just a lot. Anyway, we left, shall we? We left, we got there and he's like, oh, you know, do you want to go inside? I was like, uncle, please. I'm, please drive me back home. I'm going home. I'm not going inside. Like my friends already, my friends are telling me the concert is starting. And I just got there at 12.30. It started at like 
10.30, like, I just went back home and I just went to watch Netflix and gave up because I can't come and die, like, it's just not worth it. Um, so yeah, I'm about to, ooh, I'm about to eat breakfast this morning. I literally got two things because I feel that bad. I got yam with fish sauce and then I also got rice with plantain and a fada stew. And I want to spend the rest of the day indoors. I can't lie, well, I want to go to a nice restaurant as well though. So I'm just going to make today very much a working day. I don't think I have any energy to go out today. I might go out with my friend's friend that I was mentioned. I mentioned um, Shanice's friend. Because um, I just really fucked with her energy, man. It's very me. Um, so yeah, I... Oh, I'm going to zoom call my ticket. Frost, can you... I still haven't given you a tour of this house, but we can tour this section that I'm going into now, which is where I'm about to go work from. As you can see, my laptop is there, and yeah, and then this is it from this angle. I think that needs to be first. Oh no, it's the same day. I um, finished doing it the same with Frostman, and now I'm on my way to go meet my um, niece. At, I'm sorry, my nephew is again. Oh, God. Hello. Why do they want to check your suitcase? They've never done that. I've never seen that before. It's because of it. They see that I'm Uber. Your what? Uber. Your Uber? Why is he looking at you like that? I don't like that. Sorry about that. Um. Anyway, I'm on my way to go see my nephew, my niece and nephew. Sorry, my nephews. Jesus, it's so new to me. I'm like, my nephews. Oh my God. All right, one, two, three, let's go. Bye. See you later. Joking. All right, let's go. Come. Come here. What's that? Hey. What sign is that, Mr. Man? Put that away. Mommy, can I use knife on the bus, please? Oh, of course you can. You can use this. Yeah, we can use it. Oh, he wants a hot milkshake instead. Okay, and that is it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I really enjoyed this part of me just like talking and like watching everything back and just analyzing. We're well, not really analyzing it, but um, yeah, it was a beautiful experience. And I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I enjoyed creating it i can't wait to just bring you more and take you to more places and just bring you along on this journey of life um with the show with my personal bits and just everything on a whole Hello guys, hello guys, hello guys. Okay, a lot of smiley, a lot of freaking grinning. Why? Because when was the last time you pulled up on this channel and you saw me sitting down on my sofa talking to you? Like, like it's just, we haven't done this in a very long time. So first and foremost, happy new year. Let's start off there, happy new year. Guys, I need to breathe. God, that took, that, that, that. I felt like I was like speed talking. Anyway. So your girl went to Lagos. Um, I went to Lagos for my girl's wedding, Monica's wedding, and we had a time, like it was incredible. So I'm taking you with me, I'm taking you with me. I'm not literally going today, but I've obviously already gone. I'm, I've come back now and this is about, you're about to watch the vlog. The reason I'm talking and giving you this little intro is because there is no intro. Literally, as soon as I got to Lagos, it was like abuse and attack immediately. I had to get out of my house. Um, so yeah, and then also just to let you know that you know, maybe, maybe the vlogs are back on this channel because they are, um, you know, we tried a thing or two for a while and changes happen and this is definitely a year of change, a year of, girl, like, listen, we're back, okay, we're back, so, um, yeah, that is pretty much what I wanted to tell you, I hope you enjoy this vlog, I don't want to make the intro too long, but you will see this version of me, as in, this woman today, you will see her come up in, like, in some parts of this video, because I want to give you some context, um, because some of the clips, they're a bit like, eh, what's going on here, so I might just, like, come back and just explain real quick, so yeah, I hope you enjoy this vlog, it's such a vibe, so enjoy it, bye!